Sorry I'm on this video bone here. And today's video is going to be all what I got from BronyCon 2019. I know there's a few that might be a little upset for me going if <clears throat> if you do not want to if you're one of those people that got kind of a little mad or jealous of me, please I recommend you to be cautious of what you say to me because this is my first uh, MLP convention uh, um, of all time, so I'm still kind of new to this convention stuff. So give me a just give me some slack here and there. So without further ado, let's start the video. So we're gonna start with the plushies here. Apparently, I did not have so much room to carry by so much stuff because I had one luggage, a backpack, and my mom's purse, and that's it. Because we didn't want to carry a whole lot of stuff with us. Because we had all the clothes and all that and all the gifts that we got I got for family and relative and I was, I was visiting Baltimore. So yeah, let's get started. So the first one we're going to start, we're going to start with my big boy. Uh, Soren, which I love. I am gonna get him new socks soon. And I'm probably gonna go to like Dollar Tree or something because it's cheap and I don't need to wear them. But yeah, I think he was made pretty good, minus the stitching problem I had earlier. Um, while I was at Brown Con, I had a little issue with his hair falling off and a little bit of his wings falling off, but they were so kind enough to fix it. Which I was so grateful for, but they fixed him. But yeah, I think he's kind of cute. I think he was the biggest one I got. So I think he was the last plushie I bought at the convention center. Which I just snagged right out when I think of, when I thought about it overnight. I'm like, yeah, I think I could deserve another, um, I can deserve him because he's like one of my top three favorite, um, stallions in the, out uh, of the whole movies, out uh, of the whole show. But yeah, he is dang cute. I'm gonna put him right over there. Um, the next one I'm gonna do is this guy. It's called um, Chaos Gun. I think that's his name is. And that's where I got this, and I got the big cool van, the Van Hoover booth. So there's all the information if you might want to know, learn more about it, or you want to purchase tickets. You can go right ahead. And anyway, so I got this is my first one I bought. Because I was not sure about the big plushies and the quiet and I did not don't wanna put so much stuff in at once for the first day, so I broke it down to um two days of getting plushes. So the first and so yeah, his he is very cool. I love his eyes colors and he's like kind of like a little double. Double alicorn. Well, yeah, he is pretty cool. There's his cutie mark. Um, there it is again. And I really like the red and green on, on the tail. It's kind of nice. So, yeah, and there's also... Let me see if I can get it. Yeah, he has also a little mark on the bottom, which I found that very cool. I did not see that at first, but about halfway through it, I found it, and I found that very cool. So, yeah. That is Chaos Gun. I call him Chaos for short, because I don't want to say gun. Uh, so, the next, the last one is the one I've been dying again. Because since I heard that you made a Snowdrop plushie, I went all out and trying to find one. And here she is. She is very cute. I love her. I think she's one of my. I think she's my top favorite one I got because I've been dying to look for one for her. And yeah, she is very cute. So yeah, there's Snowdrop. There's Snowdrop right there. Next. We are going to deal with, we're going to do the badge since, since it's, oh, excuse me, excuse me, <clears throat> since I want to get this, 
so here's my badge. I was more of the four day plus badge of the convention center. So I got two other things with it. I will show you in a bit. But there's my badge. I found that to be pretty cool. Uh, there's all the information about Ronacom or to follow them, rules, yada yada yada. All that goodie. And the things I got on it is um, it's just this one, which I found that to be cool. Because since I didn't get any Ronacon stuff from the Ronacon booth, I thought this would be a nice thing to have. Since I don't have any of that, this is Farewell Ronacon 2019. Yeah, this this year, this year was the last Ronacon, so I'm. I felt sad about it, but but if it gives me all an opportunity to go to the other ones for um then second one, which I really really want to go to another one very very soon. It's not too far from my house, but I'll show you the the pan the paper thing I got there in a bit. But yeah, I found that thing very cool. And I don't know what that bad one is. If you know that bad pony's name, that Brony Con mascot, please let me know in the comments down below. Next is Starlight Glimmer. Ooh. Starlight Glimmer. I think she represents me the most. I don't know why, but she does. And this one I got for my boyfriend, which represents him the most, which is Sunburst. Which I found, I think, to be very cute. Apparently, I did not find as much Sunburst stuff as I liked. To be affordable. Only thing I found affordable was this and a few pens and a picture in a picture, in a picture or a poster, and that's it. Because the posters they were cost like a few over like two hundred and over like three hundred dollars, which I was not gonna pay that much. So I'm like, ah, oh, screw, screw it. I'm just gonna get him. I'm just gonna get this. It helps me. I got something there. Apparently, I did not get. I was one. I was really wanted again that I did not get. And they were all sold out was Thorax and King Sombra. Which I was so disappointed because I love those two to my heart. Uh, yeah, so there's that. Let's put it over there. And yeah, don't mind those buttons. I got them at a Saturday market when I was in town, when I was back home. So this is the... Convention center I'd been dying to go to, but sadly, this started a day after BronyCon, so it was between this one or BronyCon because I've been dying to go to both for ages. But I decided to go for BronyCon because it was their last, and I've been dying to go to BronyCon for a while now since um since the second year they have BronyCon, I think. But this one is the one I'm gonna go very soon. Probably my mom again. I don't know. It is not that far from where I live. It's about like a two hour drive and maybe three to four hour bus or train ride to Seattle, which is not that bad, but but hey, it's worth it. I love Seattle. I love my Seattle home. Um so there's all the information if you want to buy tickets and all that or learn for more information. Yeah, so there's that. Um we'll show them we'll show them this. So this is the pan the pan for the booklet. I got yeah, it's a little beating down just a tiny bit, which I hardly don't mind at all. But it's worth it. Uh I did get other stuff with I did get another thing with it, but I don't know where where it went to. But yeah, there's all the goody stuff. Uh, there's like all the panel stuff, all the rules and policies, all the panels and all that. The only one panel I did not get footage of because I don't want to make any. I know there's some that are kind of like, I don't want to have any spoilers and all that. But it was, um, My Little Pony Sims. Oh, wait, where did it go? Ooh. My Little Pony Sims Behind the Sims. That one was, the, 
that was the big one I've been dying to go for since i seen uh, the video of it on one of their YouTubers' channels. Yeah, so I did not get any footage of any footage of it. Because I did not want to, I know there's some that are just like, I just want to see when it comes out. I want to see when this comes. I don't want to see any spoilers. Which I understand, but I I don't want to do that because I know there's some of my f subscribers are just like, I don't want to have any spoilers. I don't want to do any of it. But yeah, that one I did see, but I did not get footage of. So yeah, that's the only panel I did not get any footage of. And another one which was kind of, eh, kind of boring, but I don't care. But yeah, and there's also, yeah, there was a lot of things to do there, but... What the heck? Oh, okay, never mind. Yeah, so there's all... Everyone... And all the marketplace and stuff. So yeah, I found this thing to be very cool, and I love this thing. Yeah. So I am going to keep this for memories, because BronyCon was so much fun. Minus the fact some of the panels there I was not very interested in. Or they were just in the way of other panels, or they were just so late at night. I don't want to stay up until midnight, because my hotel was not close to the convention center. It was by the by the airport, which was nice for me and my mom to get there so easily after we check out and all that, but for the convention center, it was kind of hard, but yeah, we tried to stay no longer than the, like 10.30, because it was a long ride, and so there transit schedules are just kind of weird for us. So yeah, there's that. So Oh. So this is the poster I got with the badge. Because, why not? And I, I found this thing to be very cool. Not joking, this thing is literally sick. I found this thing to be very cool. Um, so I might give this to my boyfriend. I'm really not too sure if he wants it, but if he does, I can make, I can, he can have it. I don't care. I got. I do want to keep this for memories, for sure. I'm not sure if I do want to give it to him or not. Uh, let's see. So, we're gonna... I only went to one autograph, because their autographs there are kind of expensive for me. And you had to pay for cash only. Which I had to, had to do one or the other. So, yeah. And yeah, there's my real... My real name is gonna be on it, if you're gonna... So, just... Play it nice for me if you're gonna. So, yeah, my real name is gonna pop up, so just be nice in the comments for me if you do tend to blab out about anything bad about me. So, yeah, there's my real name right there. So, I'm Andrea Lemon Lennon Lettern. I think I'm saying that name right. If not, I'm apologies. I don't mind the barking in the background. So yeah, this thing is literally very cool. Hey! Sorry about that, my dog was annoying me. As always. So yeah, there's the poster. I found this thing to be very cute. You wanna say hi, Shaz? Love you too. So yeah. Hello? Do you want to say hi? Hello? You want to go outside? Mm. Go outside, monkey. Anyway, sorry about that. My dog is bothering you. Bring me. No. Anyway, sorry about that. My dog just wants attention and all that. Um, yeah, so this was the only person I met because... It was a good like thirty dollars just for a picture and a autograph signature for her, and I was like, "What is enough?" 
I said, <laughs> it was between her and Lauren Faust, but in one of the panels I went to, there was Lauren Faust in the while attending the panel, which I love, which I like consider like to be a kind of a meet because I did see her in person. But yeah, she was the big one I've been dying to go to. I did get a picture of her with me and her together. Which I found out kind of nice. So, yeah. There's that. There. This one I bought at the market. I did not buy this on. I did not make this, so I bought it. So, the next thing is... Yeah. Let me show you the shirt that came with the poster, which I'm going to show you later, and the badge. Which I found this thing to be cool. So this is the back side. There's only one thing that says Brony Con. In the back side. Oh, in the front. Oh, sorry about that, guys. Uh, so yeah, this is the the front, which I love this thing to my heart. I just found this thing cute, and this is best party ever. And yeah, there's the three ma three three OC mascots. Which I found, I think, to be very cute. But yeah, there's that out of the way. And let me show you the poster that came with it. Oh yeah, I showed you the poster. Oh, never mind. <laughs> Sorry about that. I'm feeling, I'm a little tired this morning, so. So yeah, this is the last thing I'm going to show you because... I didn't get too much, as I say. I told you I didn't have a whole lot of room to put anything in. I was, I just want to make sure I didn't go over budget and all that. But yeah, this is the last shirt I got, which I didn't get a free item with it, which I can't find at the moment. But if I do find it, I'll let you guys know. Oh, there's a little something on it. I'll get it later. But yeah, there's a little Lyra and Bon Bon. Sure, which I love this thing to death. I just love them too. They're just so cute together, even though they're kind of quirky sometimes, but they're cute together. So yeah, I think they're schoolgirls, if I'm guessing this right. But yeah, I found this thing to be very cute. So yeah, this is... So yeah, this is a sh one of the other shirts I got that I didn't... This is the only shirt I bought at the market because there was not a whole lot of shirts that I liked. And there was not a whole lot of sh shirts selling. And, um, so I'm guessing that's about it. My thoughts of BronyCon was good. It was very positive. I just had to get used to the long lines, which I really did not like. But other than that, I loved it. It was a really nice convention. Not joking. I can see why people go it every 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 year because it's just wonderful. Um, I did meet a few um celebrities there. I met Lightning with like Lightning Bliss, Golden Fox, Finn the Pony, and King Possible, and a few others, which I can't remember their names. I'm sorry, <laughs> but. But I just want to say a big, big thanks to Cartoons for letting me spend time with him just to hang out and chat and go to panels with him. I just want to say thanks, Cartoons. You're the best. I love you, man. And there's some, there's two uh, there's two um, more things I do want to say. So I am going to see Adol, um in the fall. I'm not sure when in the fall quite yet. But we do this thing every year with my family, but... Yeah, so I will try to play, I will try to upload a video if there's anything new and all that. Please let me know if you want to do, I'm going to do any videos in, in, while I'm in Seattle. And yeah, so, and another thing I do want to point out, that I am going to go on my next vacation. It's going to not be 20 to 20, 20, 21, 21, yeah. 2021, once I turn 21, which is about two years from now, I'm going to go to Vegas, which has been ages since I went. It's been, good, like, what, 18, 18 and a half years since I went? So, yeah, I was a little kid when I went. I was about, like, one, or, one and a half to two and a half years old. I was very young. But, yeah, I'm going to go there. 
and maybe have a few drinks here and there. I'm gonna be old enough by then. Maybe, maybe see a show there. I'm not sure. We're still working out the tiny details. And oh, one more thing. A big, big, big announcement is I get. I asked that all my college classes settle when I got back from BronaCon. That one day, I am not gonna post. Any videos because I have a night class is like 6 to 9 p.m. I'm gonna get home until like 10 or 11, which I had to get used to it. But the only days I am not gonna post videos is Monday, Tuesday, wait, Monday and Wednesday are the only probably the only ones I'm not gonna post any videos because they're gonna be later classes. And yeah, I don't want to do any of that. I might do one for Tuesday and Thursday. I'm not too sure if I'm gonna post anything around those days. But Friday, Saturday, and Sunday are going to be a big yes if I don't get called into work. But, yeah. So, yeah. So, as I just also want to point out that, um, that I also, that I kind of like still, um, yeah. It's just one of the big thing is school just got in the way a little bit. I need to get everything ready. I have to do things later today. I have to get my school supplies done. I have to get everything ready. Make sure my my email for the school for school was set up. Yeah, so apologies if this is a late video. I am so sorry. I hope you guys understand. And yeah, so as always, I will link all my um social media minus my brand new Facebook page and my Discord account because I'm working on Discord a little bit and I'm trying to figure out what's going on, what happened to my hacked, what happened to my account was hacked and we're not sure what happened but I will post it very soon please please follow my MeWe account and I'll let you guys know if, if when that will happen and what will my username will be and all that uh, yeah, as always, guys, this is PDX Bowl. PDX Bowl signing out. As always, guys, stay adventurous, my explorers. Bye!